This is the Lower Santa Ana River Channel, Reach 9, BNSF Railroad Bridge Protection, a project for the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. The stakeholders include Orange County, Riverside County, BNSF Railway, and Green River Golf Course. The project is designed to improve the scour protection of the BNSF Railway Bridge Foundations during large discharges of the Prado Dam, which is one mile upstream from the project's site. The original BNSF bridge was designed for scour depths of 14 feet in 1995, but due to the Prado Dam being modified to handle larger discharge flows, scour depths of over 30 feet have the potential to occur. The existing railroad bridge includes three main tracks that carry more than 80 freight and passenger trains daily, which intensifies the project coordination. Here we are along the Santa Ana River alignment for the center of the project site. Work is continuing on piers four and five for the pier protection and pier nose extensions, which will provide the final protection for the bridge along the river alignment. The diaphragm walls for the abutments include challenging T panels designed as cantilever walls due to the proximity to the existing bridge foundations. The railroad bridge must remain active during construction. Therefore, work must be performed from under the bridge with overhead clearances of 30 feet. This requires a specially designed low overhead hydro cutter to perform panel excavation to depths of approximately 90 feet. The hydromill mud pump connected to a six inch suction line transport the slurry and the soil and rock cuttings to the desanding plant. At the desanding plant, after treatment, the clean bentonite slurry is transported back to the excavation to continue the panel. Based on these height restrictions, the reinforcing steel cages require as many as five splices during installation at each panel location. The Santa Ana River currently runs directly through the project work area. Due to extensive planning, preparation, and execution, the work areas are able to be quickly restored during any major weather events to allow work to continue. Daily weather and river conditions are assessed and monitored at all times using multiple tools, including constant contact with the dam operator. The project team has worked very hard to establish an emergency action plan with all stakeholders to reduce risk for all parties and ensure the safety of personnel at all times. One technical challenge is the excavation of the diaphragm wall in the existing riverbed. The subsurface conditions include layers of sand, gravels, cobbles, and boulders. Additionally, the integrity of all diaphragm wall panels is being tested utilizing cross-hole sonic logging for acceptance. Excellent QC measures are being applied on all work phases from excavation to support fluid preparation, rebar placement, and tremie concrete placement to ensure the highest standards are being achieved. The diaphragm wall work will continue followed by the installation of tieback anchors at each bridge abutment. The over 100 foot long tieback anchors are installed through the diaphragm wall and have loads of up to 500 kips. Upon project completion, not only will this project provide protection for the BNSF Railway Bridge, but will also provide protection to the adjacent communities for years to come. 